Hey y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome back to my basement on this today where I'm attempting to catch up. Attempting being the operative word for the boys. It is season four, episode four. I love it when the seasons and the episodes match up. I don't know why, I just do. But in my real world, it is July 3rd and the reservation is right there. So we may be hearing fireworks in the background so also people are still awake in the house so you will hear creaking floors it's just gonna be so but we are catching up okay so so i i don't know if we've had much momentum in the story yet i don't think i'll be ever able to hear the words ice capade and not go uh, uh, ever again the beef is hooking up the beef <laughs> the deep is hooking up with Sage, okay. But what about Ambrosia? I fear for her safety. I fear for her safety. Butcher's trying to go with the genuine tactic <laughs> with Ryan. Go figure. And Homelander is cracking. He's, he's cracking, literally. He is cracking, which means death. Death is imminent. Uh-huh. <laughs> but I'm excited to get to it. Sure, and I know you are as well. So we are going to get cozy under the blanket for protection. I'm also just drinking stuff because why not? I hope you have your favorite beverage as well. And you remember full episode watch along is available on Patreon where I would love to see you. So let's gird our loins and let's get to it. Project Odessa. Oh, are we 1987? The security cameras upstairs just went black. Phil, anyone up there? Do I need to gird my loins already? That little man with his little gun thinks that's gonna stop anybody that comes through that elevator. They do know who they work for, right? Hello, everyone. Hey, John. Home later. Hey, Marty. Good to see you. <laughs> you too. <laughs> sure it is. Mm -hmm. Surreal. I never thought I'd be back here. So many memories. I see some new faces, but a lot that I recognize. Frank and and assistant director now, Marty. Where's Barbara? Last I checked, she's still director. She's off site today. I uh, could bring her in, would you? I'd love to catch up. Bring her in. Terrific. All right, everyone, dig in. I'm still tense. What is that? What is that? Oh, that's how you die. That's how you die just a regular life. What are you doing? Dying, he's dying. Get out. Oh, she got a manicure and all for this ghost haunting. I'm sorry, your father's condition meets the criteria for brain death. Might not seem like it, but it is the most humane thing. They're gonna take him off. Take him off the things. Huey, it's what he wanted. To starve to death? Mm. How long before? Um... A couple of days at most. What you thinking there, pumpkin? Get an exclusive sneak peek of training eight. Tonight, 8, 7 central on the whole. The whole truth! Deck night! Marie Moreau and the other Godolkin 4 have seemingly vanished into. Oh, right. I read the draft of your soup control bill. Let me guess. It's perfect, but you know just how to fix it. Like, if you get it passed, that's a stake through Vault's heart. But that's if you get it passed. What is your suggestion? I can get people into the streets. You'll do it as Starlight? Yes. I'll even make another fucking super suit if I have to. And what do you get for this? Just a promise. Promise me you'll finish what you started. Bob. Is Bob's plan just to get superheroes out of power or to get rid of superheroes? Across the My dad used to play this all the time in the car, and I'd fall asleep to it in the back seat. You never 
told me about them. I don't think we should open this can of worms, Frenchie. When my mom wasn't on my ass in my grades, she was a federal judge. And there was this Russian mafia thing in. Nina. Some guy broke in and they found my parents first. You were there. The gunshots woke me up. I heard him coming down the hallway, so I just hid under my bed. All I saw was his ankle. He had these scars, all these burns, maybe. You haven't looked at his ankles yet? He hasn't looked at his ankles yet? And you're wondering, yes, why would you see someone's ankles if you're having sex? Well, there's just some positions where you're looking at ankles. Breakfast? Sample, right now. He's just standing up. See his ankles. You gotta go. He has to go. Let's call in Stacy and Mark. We need to get an announcement ready. Why Stacy and Mark they quit? <gasps> Ew. Oh. So far, Starlight's progressive jihad and hashtag arrogant white feminism are showing promise. We need the algorithm to find the most receptive users. Dope. Heroes, you have your talking points. So, everyone, get to it. Hey, can we talk? No. No. <laughs> so, I was thinking over lunch we could order some of those fried pickles from Flavor Town. I find you repulsive in a way that's difficult to quantify. And I'm fucking amazing at quantifying, so. Well, that spigot turned off right quickly. You know, when I first met you, I thought you were kind of uppity, but you're one of the good ones. We are the new kids in the seven. Mm -hmm. Gotta look out for each other. I don't feel like Sage is playing everybody. Now I know a lot of you probably know me from a podcast. But VNN gave me the next six hours to bring Six you. hours. Six hours. Firecracker celebrity friends are arriving. Such a void. <laughs> wow. Wow. Bringing them back in. <gasps> you are? What? How? What? You're insane if you do. What happened, MM, to you're on your own? You had, that was your last chance. That shit Homeland and Sage are talking about, that's some end of time shit. Team has shot one total asshole and we need this mother. This is my call. You get me 50K from the company and in three hours, I'll have all the dirt we need. I know who must guns and ammo. And Kanye West! But first, a sermon by Ezekiel. Oh, Ezekiel! Ezekiel. God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Hey Frank, come on over. Mm-mm, mm-mm. How about a game of waste paper basketball? I'm sorry? I'm gonna throw your head into the basket. You win, I'll let you knock off early, go see the fam. Okay, excellent. You didn't ask what happens if you lose. I learned this game from you, Frank. I once saw you take a shot of the waste basket and you nailed it and and you don't remember. Well, I was in this oven here. You made the shot, you did a little fist pump to celebrate, and then you turned up the temperature to see if you could burn my skin. I remember there was uh, people standing here taking notes, but behind them, I saw you make that shot. I was just doing my job. You know, I had nightmares about that exact moment, and you can't even remember it. People can have such a, a different memory of the exact same thing. Oh, that's so true, that's so true, but I'm scared now. It's all a matter of perspective, I guess. He's cracking! He's cracking! Hey, Frank. Mm, you're gonna die now. This is my last shot. Why don't you go and watch from in there? John, <gasps> why don't we... Homelander. Why don't you go watch it from in there? Get in the oven, Frank. <laughs> Please. Frank, you're going in the oven. Please, Homelander, you don't have to Marty. do this. You're next. <laughs> I'm so, so sorry. You're sorry? Now. Now? Now. 
Who I? You were just doing your job, right? Bye, Marty. Nope, Frank. Bye, Frank. Bye, Frank. Frank, there goes Frank. <sighs> Put down the cake, folks. Put down the cake. I forgive you. They're all dying. Maybe you should have tried to snuck out while he was distracted. If you could. He was with Kimiko? Yeah. Ooh. He called A-Train? I'm the one that called you. Are you crazy? I need a dose of Compound V, and I need it today. It's too dangerous. No, hey, fuck that! You owe me! I just saved your fucking life! Every single fucked up, horrible thing that's ever happened to me, to all of us, it all started with you! Now you're gonna give someone I love back. This is your chance. So who's scoping them? If I do this, we're good. Forever? Yes. Mm -mm. Kimiko, I'm sorry, but it's my dad. What else was I supposed to do? Oh. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Who the fuck are those guys? Oh. So, yeah, we don't know who these guys are specifically at Dewey. Okay. Yeah, tape them up. <laughs> who the fuck are those guys? Lights, shining light, shining light. Why are they after us? Yeah, how did they know that they were there? Fuck. That's not gonna. Oh. That little. <laughs> so, do we know how bulletproof? Okay. 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 Damn, I got it. That is. Bulletproof that little piece of metal. Love lift us up where we belong. Where the eagles cry on a mountain. There's no crowd. <laughs> Not a word about that 50 grand and what happened to it, the mallet. Heroin enemas don't come cheap, my son. Anyway, don't matter. We've got what we needed. Job done. Web Weaver. You ever gonna tell me what happened with that gash on your face? That's what happened with the gash on his face. Emma got a favor to ask. You're in the position to ask for a favor? I think it's the same favor as before. Save Ryan. 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 Ryan, we're saving Ryan. I need you to get Ryan away from Homelander. Get him out of there. Raise him. Raise him. You're the best dad I know, him. Eh? Raise him. What's up, not show, love? Well, you're those motherfuckers that killed my friend. Yeah, cry and shame that. But if it's any consolation, he's up there with God, noshing. Oh, look how they made his eyes all bloodshot. That's brilliant. You remember that magical summer when you was 28, working as a counselor at the Capes for Christ Bible Camp? You and your little beaver edging in the back of your RAV4 in the car park of Booker the Beppo. Everything you know about Sage and her grand plan. Or I hit this little tweet button here. That's it? That's all they have on her, though? I would need a little more. I have I just sent it myself. I'm sorry, I got interrupted. I'm so sorry. I need to confess my sins. Ain't no way to sugarcoat this. I had inappropriate relations with a sweet young man. The moment of my greatest weakness was also the moment that pushed me to my eternal salvation. I was born again, and my sins were washed away by the tears of his love. Y'all ever hear that story about her very first save? But what they don't tell you is that she blinded one of those hostages that day. She just went on smiling for those cameras like none of it ever happened. 
<laughs> Why are they looking at her like that? I was still learning how to control my powers. I... Superheroes are dangerous. Mademoiselle Annie. Oh, Annie's upset. A train's gonna get, oh no. Don't touch. Don't touch. Don't touch. You don't think there's cameras there? I have two dads. Oh no. <laughs> For a man who's supposed to be fast, you are going slower than hell, sir. A train. What the fuck are you doing here? Bro? What are you doing there? What are you doing there? What the hell are you doing in here? Nothing. Huh. <laughs> you left a floater in his toilet? That was there when I got here. Hmm. Oh, 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 that's a detail. That's a detail. God, who's next? Who's next? Marty. Mm -hmm. Come here for a sec. <sighs> I'd like to apologize for Frank. Can you forgive me? Of course. These things, these things happen. Thank you. You were always one of the kinder ones. That's right, John. <laughs> I was always nice to you. Except for when. You were. Mostly. Who you remember the nickname you had for me, right? Was it the little shit? Squirt. Mm. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you were always watching, were you, Marty? Growing boys have certain needs, shall we say. Oh, God. Oh, God. That when you did your rounds at night, I had about a couple of minutes to myself to, uh, well, to, um, to do what boys do. <laughs> oh, Lord. Be the only time of day that I would feel anything good. <laughs> you had a really, really good laugh at me. Remember? You do now. That's when you nicknamed me Squirt. You really hurt my feelings. I am. Very sorry. You're going to be. Jeez, this is a lesson in um, the shit you do comes back to you. Karma. Water under the bridge. Karma. <laughs> I do want you to jerk off in front of us right now. And then I'm going to, and then I'm going to kill you. Come on. Yeah. We're all going to laugh at you. So what are these people working on now? If this is where they experimented on Homelander, who are they experimenting on now? Or what? <laughs> Homelander. Does this look like a man that can be reasoned with? That's the spirit. <laughs> Marty, it looks like you're shucking a little mushroom. <laughs> Tell you what, I'll, I'll give you a little motivation. You get hard right now, or I'm gonna lazy your dick off. <laughs> Use it or lose it, Marty. Your life is literally in your hands. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> I can't. Come on, Marty. No, you're gonna die, Marty. Oh, oh okay, okay, okay. It's okay. Honestly. It... <laughs> oh. Yeah, we knew that was coming. Oh, he's still alive. He's still alive. <laughs> he's still John. alive. <gasps> Stop it. Oh, Barbara. Please put him out of his misery. 
Oh, wow. I forgive you, Marty. <gasps> Can we talk in private? Uh-uh. That's a great idea. I know just the place. <gasps> It'd be more comfortable in my office. Well, good on you, Barbara, for trying to get everybody else out of the way, but oh, you tried. <laughs> I didn't need to see it. I got it. I get it. I get it. It's. Oh, no, Kimiko, that was Kimiko that got blasted in two. Oh, no. Oh, no. I was squinting. Oh, Huey. Well. Oh, good Lord. 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 Ah! <laughs> So how about, okay, okay, you're, oh, you do what you can. How, ooh, how much of your fighting training with, with Annie is coming into play? So excessive. So excessive. So excessive. So excessive. <laughs> Anymore out there. Okay. I screamed at the shots at the Kazuk Kara Hikihanashta, not Rankun Yoshkonda Koto. Oh, not his sister. She, oh, reeled them in. Bonjour. I think I'm just going to permanently glue my fingers to my ears. Don't touch, don't touch. Six months ago, Starlight visited a clinic. She found out that she was pregnant. And she had an abortion. Are those my fucking medical records? Did she for reals? So you want to tell me that those teens over there, that they're safe with her, with that baby killer? Oh, Annie. What do you think? Oh, Jesus. So embarrassing. I'm Firecracker's biggest fan. I was just looking for our souvenir. <laughs> Murdered it! So you finally came to the. <gasps> oh! Oh, okay. That's the tactic we're going with then. Um. Oh, this has gone sideways. Boy. Oh. <gasps> Oh, it's broken now. There you go. You're losing it. Um, Annie? Annie? How's that for uppity? Cracker. Um. Stop. Look. Look? Look! Now? A little too late. What is that thing? Billy. Is it gonna come out of his eyeball? <laughs> Somebody exploded. Ezekiel exploded. Um. How? What the fuck happened? Come on, let's get the fuck out of there. <laughs> Wait, where did, where did Butcher get his, 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 his crowbar? All right, was just stuck in the back of his coat. Like, okay. <sighs> Meanwhile. I remember it 
being so much. And it's a storage unit you know now. You used to call this the, the bad room? It's a storage unit now. No. Did you come back here just to torment those people? Doesn't that feel a little, little small? Not one of them had the backbone to stand up and say, this is wrong. I was there the day that you were born. But you lasered her guts open from the inside. You rose in the air with your umbilical cord still attached like some creature out of myth. You killed three doctors and a nurse. Yeah, everybody was terrified of you. We have no physical power over you. We never did. You could have broken out of here any time you wanted. Because you couldn't stand the idea that we would be disappointed in you. Your need for approval and for love <gasps> but brought in the best psychologists in the world. We developed the protocol to carefully engineer that need so that you would be obedient. <gasps> Oh, wow. In many ways, that was our greatest success. Oh, no. She just broke that tether now. Your need for love is so deep. It's so human. You'll never be able to overcome that. I'm not human. And neither is my son. You know, I really do want to share with you why I called this the bad room. Welcome back. You okay? I feel like I've been fixing you up so much lately. I should build your HMO. Going boom, please stop! Stop what? being so fucking nice to me! It was me. Here it comes, here it comes. What, what was you? Pull up the bed like. It was you? Psychopath! Yeah. He'll let you do it. He'll let you do it. Kevin. Yeah, so you want to see me? Oh, oh, she called for him. It's your way of apologizing? I need a favor. <laughs> well, what is that? Most people, their brains grow till they're about 25, then stop forever. Mine doesn't. Stab me in the brain, and the little fucking bitch grows back. That's what, how has she been stabbed? I want you to put this inside me. Um. Wow. Still what I've ever seen, but. No. In my eye. <gasps> in her eyeball. Why in her eye? I am down for, like, a lot. Why in her eye? Why in her eye? Does her eye grow back? You give me a frontal lobotomy, and I don't have to fucking be me for a couple hours. That's just fucking gross. I'll let you ass fuck me while we watch the Kim and Ray J video. Okay, so where do you want me to put it? Just right there? In her eyeball. Now avoid the eye itself. I don't want to go blind. <laughs> it's the show. I can't, I can't, I can't. Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Now, use the hammer. The hammer? Fuck. Tap, tap. No, no. No, no, no. No, no. Again. Why? Why? Okay, story creators. We get it. We don't need this. We don't need this. Scrape my fucking brains out. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. No, 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 no. Uh, uh. Okay. 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 Uh, uh. Can't take it. Uh. Uh, uh. Hey, are you okay? I need a hug. I need a hug so bad right now. I have another flavor town for you. My pussy. Yes. Oh, that's how she gets high. <laughs> While I respect President-elect Singer, it's disheartening to see him align himself with Starlight, someone so clearly out of control. Oh, Annie, you played right into their hands. Gosh, I need the boys to get a win. I need them. I always need them to get a win. And it seems they never, ever, ever rarely do. Look, I saw the firecracker thing. That fucking asshole. No, no, I shouldn't have lost it. How could you not lose it? That was like the most private thing between you and me. Oh, he knew about it. Interesting. I agonized over that decision. 
You know I did, I just wasn't ready. I have to relive it over and over and over again. And my mom, she won't return my calls. I don't think she owes her mom any explanation, really. That's her, this is her business. It's her business. It is nobody's business but yours. Exactly, Huey. The soup control bill would have passed with flying colors. Yeah. But after what you pulled today. Actually, actually, I got a thought. I have a thought. I can't be affiliated with you anymore. Okay, thought. I think Bob could spin this with, yes, look to, look, see how much we have to put a control on soups. One that's on our side went, ooh This bullshit, right? You're not going to forgive me. Yeah, thought so. Wait. I don't know if I forgive him necessarily, however. I was going to tell you to go fuck yourself, but I changed my mind. To a point. You fucking dog wanker. Hmm. Everyone's following everybody. Oh, could you? I, I, didn't, I didn't do it for him. I don't want to spend the rest of my life hating anybody. Look, you're probably the only guy that would understand, but I was going to give it to my dad. Oh, God. Oh, God, what powers is dad going to get while in a coma? You're really telling me that you wouldn't take some if you were in his shoes? Because you kind of are. There's enough here. to save you, too. <laughs> That's what killed I already took some. Nicked it out of Frenchie's desk four months ago. Thought it might kill me. Oh. Oh, hey. 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 How is he? The doctor said any time now. No, no. Um, I just need some air. What was that look on her face for? No, <laughs> accepting Vot coin. Okay. Okay. <laughs> She's got to look. What is that? Who did that? Did he drop it? And what did she How does she know what it was? How does she know what it was? This is when he gets some kind of creepy powers. And this is this is the scene from the trailer with Homelander covered in blood. Yeah, I remember the scene. <gasps> he left her alive. Oh. I should not have watched this just before going to bed. So I ask myself often when it comes to the boys, why do I subject myself to this? What do I enjoy about it? Because the carnage and the disappointments really weigh on me. Sometimes the carnage is funny, which sounds terrible to say. It's creative. Mm. Can I form a sentence? I don't know. I've always, I say often, I find the creative process fascinating. So when I see something as crazy pants as the ice capade, I find joy in the whole process of somebody thinking of it, pitching it, casting it, putting it together, lighting choreography down the road until we see it. That whole process, I find fascinating. So sometimes when I see scenes that are just Bleh! They make me laugh with joy at that creative process. And then there are scenes like the fight with Kimiko and the shiny light group and Huey that were just not overkill. It felt a little gratuitous because I don't feel it was as creative as the ice capade scene from the last episode. Am I making sense? So when I'm seeing just obsessively bleh, violence, <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Do you get what I'm not saying? Do you get what I'm not saying? I enjoy the characters. 
I hate Homelander with a passion, which means they're doing their job. I hate Homelander with a passion. The scene with Barbara, Barbara, and he left Barbara alive. Fascinating choice. Sage with the thing in her eye. Okay, you can tell me she needs her brain scrape. Okay, I didn't need to see it though. It went from order an idea to too far rather quickly. And they're losing again. They lose all the time. <laughs> they lose all the time. Even when they get a win, it's not a win. It's a loss. And now I'm getting sad and depressed. So, so. Why do I keep watching? Because I hope someday <laughs> my little happily ever after love and heart hopes that I will get the happily ever after and the good guys will prevail. And the bad guys will get beat to shit. Are we gonna get it? I don't know. So what do you all think? <laughs> How do you feel? When you watch this, do you go, this is great, I don't care what it is. Give me all the gore. Or are you hoping that they prevail and you're riding the wave of shit, hoping we get to the promised land. Yeah, that's my question for all of you. They're literally not th pulling any punches with this one. Wow, okay, so I'm catching up. I got a couple more to go. I want you there with me. Please send me the, I need the hugs. I need to know that there's someone out there mentally giving me the hug. It's hysterical. Okay, well, there we go. Uh, episode four, four and four. Thank you so much for being with me. And as I always ask of you, please take care of yourself. This is your reminder to go. I don't want to say go eat. Could you eat after that? Could you, could you go have a fudgy whale? <laughs> Drink some water, stretch your bodies, and then come back and watch the next video in the queue. So thanks again, you all, and until next time.